as the temperatures drop around the country, more birds will be making a temporary home here in the Tennessee Valley. News Channel 9's Lauren St. Germain joins us now to show us what types you can expect to see. Lauren. Yes, Josh and Latricia, tis the season to find more birds in our area thanks to migration. So now until about mid-February, thousands of birds will go to one area in particular, the Hawassi Wildlife Refuge. And today we actually went on a boat tour to show you what it's like. And even if you're not a bird person, it's pretty cool. Take a look. And we're off, traveling on the Tennessee and Hiawassee River on the River Gorge Explorer. The destination, the Hawassi Wildlife Refuge, which includes this island and the surrounding area. The Hiawassee region here in Tennessee is one of the largest uh, congregations of wintering sandhill cranes in the whole eastern United States. Bill Haley works in education at the Tennessee Aquarium. He says the Hiawassee Refuge was originally formed for waterfowl, like ducks, in the winter. And they planted corn and the, the sandhill cranes love the corn and they found out that the, there's, there's a good store of food here. The population started soaring after they did this in the 1990s. Haley says there are only about 40,000 sandhill cranes in the eastern United States and a quarter of them end up migrating here. They come from Canada and the Great Lakes area. But because this area is so rich in food, there are now a lot more than sandhill cranes. Check out these bald eagles. Haley says bald eagles will migrate here in the winter because there's so much food. On our trip today, we saw close to 20. You can see many more big birds in one day here than, than you could see most anywhere else in the eastern U.S. Now we want to show you a picture up close of a sandhill crane. This is actually what it looks like. Their wingspan is five to six feet, so they're very large and they can weigh anywhere from six to 14 pounds. Latricia. Lauren, thank you. There are several opportunities in January to go on this cruise yourself. For more information on the sandhill crane tours and how to get tickets, visit our website, newschannel9.com.